Hey there and welcome to Reina Reviews. Today I am talking about the Whimsy Murtailer Tale. I've already done a video on the Fantasy Fin. You can check that out in the links below. And if you're here because you want to see a comparison between the Fantasy Fin and the Fantasy Fin 2, or between these tales and other tales, you'll have to check back because I'm going to be doing different videos for those. <laughs> oh, it's perfect. But it's cute. That was funny. I got a good picture of that. So I love my whimsy tail so much. This is the first one I got, the Aqua Fairy. I really love the colors, it's really beautiful. And one of the things I will let you know about this tail is that since I got this first one, the fabric has actually been greatly improved. These first generation ones had an issue um, with fabric that would pill a little bit. And it didn't really bother me at all. I mean, I can barely notice it. Um, but some mermaids really didn't like it. The new fabric, I mean, you can't really see a difference, but I can feel a difference. Both of them are really, really stretchy, really awesome. Colors are really vibrant. I would say that you can just go to your closest size. It's not gonna be too tight. Don't even worry about it. It's really comfortable for how it adjusts. And the new fabric just honestly just feels a little bit more sturdier. And you can feel the difference between this and this. Like you can feel that this feels a little bit like leggings and can get like that pillow pill thing going on. And this one you can feel like it doesn't. So anyone who's getting a new one, you're getting the new fabric. You're so lucky. It's really awesome. Very beautiful, vibrant colors. I really love it. Beautiful patterns. Everybody asked me why I went with the uh, Aqua Fairy first. And, you know, I have a lot of orange tails. I just wanted something different. So the first time I used this, I actually used it for a bachelorette party because it was easy for me to get the tail on and off so that I could give lessons and have my legs really quickly if I needed it. I can get this on in seconds. I can get it off the entire tail and the monofin hands-free. It's amazing. So if I needed to get this off in an emergency or if you're a beginner mermaid who's a little bit nervous about your capabilities in the water, oh my God, these are perfect for that. So easy. One of the things I love about the Mertailer tails is that when you're looking at this, this is the entire monofin. The monofin fills the entire fluke, so there's no drag. It's really, really awesome. I haven't had a chance to swim in this color yet, um, but I really love it. It is a bit of a smaller monofin. If you prefer something bigger, you may want to go for the Fantasy 2, and I'm, I'll be doing a comparison video. But this is really great because look, you can fold this up and put it in your luggage. It's so easy. You can put it in a backpack. It's not very heavy at all. I'd say it's like what, like eight or nine pounds, if that, like maybe not even that. I'll have to wait, I'm not 100% sure. <laughs> um, you get that really nice floppiness. And yeah, like I said, the monofin fills out the entire tail. So you don't get this ballooning fabric problem that you get with other fabric tails. It also doesn't shift around the way that fin fun tails do, and I'll be doing a comparison um, on that later. But it really just comes across very beautifully. So swimming with it, First, I need to give you the disclaimer that I am not the best swimmer when it comes to fabric tails. Because I am a very, very, very buoyant mermaid, I tend to float a lot and experience a lot of drag. So I need to either wear a weight belt or I need a monofin that gives me a lot of push or I need a tail that's really heavy because I just, I spend most of my energy just trying to get underwater. So when you are looking at videos of me swimming in fabric tails, it it's not necessarily representative of what it would be like for you swimming in a fabric tail. I'm just very buoyant. But if you are like me and you're very buoyant, the really cool thing is that you can hide weight belts in these fabric tails super, super easily. You don't even know they're there. And I've done a video tutorial showing that. You can check it out in the comments or in my YouTube videos to see more. So you can actually do that. And look at the beautiful little tag here. <laughs> so cute. I also have a, um, a live stream of opening these tails that you can find on my Facebook and YouTube as well. So swimming with it, I really loved how light it felt. I loved how agile it could be. For me, um, the push was about on par with a thinnest foil, which is what I have in my orange silicone tail. 
And so it, for me, it didn't have a huge amount of push, but it was really perfect for being able to do flips, turns, corkscrews, things like that. Those are hard to do in a wider, heavier, um, bigger monofin basically like when I'm using a competitor monofin it is so rigid that when I try to do flips I kick myself in the head with it sometimes <laughs> but with this it's really good the only time I kick myself in the head with this is when I go down and try to uh, <laughs> take pictures and flip it up behind me I did that in my <laughs> unboxing video by mistake <laughs> um, as I've said in the video where I reviewed just the monofin. It is super de duper comfortable, so comfy. It is the comfiest monofin. Um, the only one that's comfier in my opinion is the Fantasy Fin 2. I keep accidentally calling them the Final Fantasy Fins. <laughs> that's what I'm calling them, Final Fantasy Mermaid Fins. Which I just so happen to have right here. This thing is amazing. It's very floppy and flowy. Look at this. How oh, mermaid is that? <laughs> Mark Taylor has done it. He has innovated it, and let me tell you, it is so amazing and so, so, so comfortable. No blisters, no ankle pain, no bruises. It's amazing. It's so amazing. So, for the swimming, I think these are really great for beginner mers. I think they're really great for people who maybe like me have gotten a bit too used to compensating for their swimming with silicone tails or with really expensive monofins. For me when I swim in these tails it forces me to really really work on my form and go back to the basics of mermaid swimming because the only way I'm going to get from point A to point B is if I do that kick correctly. But when I'm wearing a silicone tail and I've got like a competitor monofin in it and one kick sends me across the pool. Eh, not really focused on my form, right? I'm kind of cheating a little bit there. So I love training in these tails so much. I love training in them. It's so perfect because I can just take it discreetly to the pool, put it on, don't need to lube up and have this whole to-do where I'm getting the tail on. I can swim, I can practice my flips, I can do my tricks, I can really focus on my buoyancy issues. Maybe I'm just practicing equalizing in a tail. It's just so convenient. They're so easy to put in a bag, put in your luggage without having to pay all this extra. You could put this tail in your carry-on luggage. And when I go to do some international travel in 2019 and 2020, I'm totally planning on bringing my Mertailer tails instead of like, you know, my $5,000 silicone tails because I can put them in a carry-on. It's so amazing. And look at these colors. Look at this. I just love it. Um, they're fantastic for photo shoots too because you can put them in a bag, go for a hike, and take some photos. I haven't done any photos in my orange one yet, but I can't wait. I've done some in my purple. Um, and also, they're just like so realistic looking, the prints. The prints look like a silicone tail. Like, look at this print. Like, that looks like a silicone tail. This is something that you could use for gigs, right? I maybe wouldn't use it for like a birthday party because my clients pay for the silicone tails, but for giving lessons and for bachelorette parties, for parades where I'm going to be sitting on a float and I don't want to damage my silicone and I don't want to be like dying in the heat in a 50 pound silicone tail. This is breathable. It's breathable. You can like your skin can breathe in this. You don't have to worry about getting disgustingly sweaty. So I just love them. I'm a huge, 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 huge fan of these tails. Um, so much so that I'm gonna be selling off a bunch of my old fabric tails in the future so that I can buy more of these so that when I give lessons to people, I can put them in these. You can also get versions of these tails that fit the Mermaid Linden monofin. So if you're not quite ready for a silicone monofin, you can go for hers as well. Also really good for beginners. And there's a neoprene version too. Um, this is like um, in between fabric. The whimsy is like in between bathing suit and neoprene. Um, it's not quite neoprene, it's not quite bathing suit. You kind of get the best of both worlds. So it's not see-through or anything like that when it's wet. You could wear leggings inside this and you wouldn't see them. It's really cool. And yeah, they don't need to really have, you see all these other tails have like the opening here. You don't need it because the fabric is porous enough that the air and water goes through. And because the monofin fits the whole fluke, there's no air bubbles or drag. I just love it. I 
love it so much. <laughs> if you love it as much as me, or if you want to love it as much as me, you can use my discount code RAINA10, all capital letters R-A-I-N-A-10, for 10% off at mertailor.com on all fabric mermaid tails and fabric clothing. Get you a 10% discount. If you like my videos, if you want to see uncut videos, if you want to see them before everyone else, if you want access to stuff that's not available to anybody else, if you want some special merch, if you want to own my books at a cheaper price, if you want some discount codes, check me out on Patreon. I am on there and for as little as $2 a month, you can get all this and more. I'll even be hosting some giveaways. You might be able to win a fabric tail. Who knows? <laughs> so check me out on there. Please like and subscribe to my YouTube channel. Best fishes! <laughs> Don't eat me! Don't eat me! Don't eat me! <laughs> Here she goes. You gonna sit on your bum? <laughs>